Ladies and gentlemen, this bout is scheduled for three three-minute rounds of the Kogo Featherweight Division, brought to you tonight by Element 7 Productions. Strategic video production, delivering precision video marketing solutions. And now, ladies and gentlemen, introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner. The striker stands five foot eight, weighed in 145 pounds. Yields an amateur record, two wins, two defeats, with one win coming by way of knockout. Representing Team Synergy, fighting out of Brenton, Washington, Alex Dunn. His opponent across the Koga cage, fighting out of the red corner, is a striker standing 5'9", weighed in 145.6 pounds. Yields an amateur record, one win, one defeat, but that win coming by way of knockout. Representing Bang Muay Thai and Gracie Baja Renton, fighting out of Renton, Washington, Alex Chavez. Your referee in charge of the action, Jeff Hoiby. Here we go, Alex Dunn, Alex Chavez. Fight one, round one. Hoiby checking on both fighters. Touch up right in the center of the cage. That one's here. Alex with a nice uh, right leg kick. Ooh, body shot and a right hand landed on each other. Guys filling, the out, filling each other out a little bit. Both guys got the Muay Thai shorts though, so let's see what we got going on here. I'm expecting to see some kicks, some punches, some knees. Alex Dunn, like I said, is coming from a karate background. He should have some pretty effective kicks. That straight stance he does shows that karate back on kind of like Stephen Bobo Thompson. There's a one two that landed. Yeah, nice right hand by Dunn there. The karate versus versus boxing a little bit, maybe? Yeah. Oh. Again, both guys being nice and patient, filling each other out. You don't see this in the early fight sometimes. Nice clean jab by Alex Dunn. Again with a nice job. Ooh. Chavez is looking for that overhand right. I was going to say, both guys are respecting each other's power here. But those leg kicks are going to pay off if they keep landing. That leg's already red. Yeah, Alex done. Nice job. Nice right leg kick. Keep it simple. I like that. I feel like Alex Chavez. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. That uppercut came through, but it was answered. Chavez is hunting that right hand. Dunn's throwing straight punches. Yeah, nice straight punches by Dunn. I'd like to see Alex uh, Chavez use his jab a little bit more to set up that right hand. Oh. Like, oh. Yeah, because when the right hand comes through, it, it does connect. Yeah, nice Look, he, he points at Dunn's eye and lets him know. Yeah, that thing's marked up. I caught it, but. Yeah. Boom again. Nice, nice short, kind of looping right hand, but it's very effective. And his accuracy is pretty damn good yeah. with it. Almost had our first wrestling scramble of the night there. Good way to get the crowd started with a nice stand-up battle. Everybody loves that. And Dunn needs to stop backing away towards the cage. He needs to make sure he has room because he's going to get his occasion now because he's going to land that right hand. Yeah, every time Alex connects with that right, or uh, every time Chavez connects with that right hand, he points and laughs at it. Ooh. Nice knee to the those body. Those kicks, body shots. Nice first Solid round. first round. I, uh, I don't know. Yeah, you know, both guys staying nice and composed for, for uh, you know, for younger fighters, it's good to see that. Composure, both guys coming from legit gyms though. Center G Peak versus Bang Muay Thai. I mean, you know what I mean? They have a good crew behind them, they're ready to rock. And it seems if one guy threw, the other guy had an answer for it. So I don't really know which way that would go if I was a judge. On out of round number two, scheduled for three in this featherweight matchup brought to you once again by Element 7 Productions. Strategic video production delivering precision video marketing solutions. You see the replay of that action that was going on. There's that right hand. Alex kept landing this towards the end of the fight. Those body shots, the knees from each other. There was those body shots that Dunn was rocking. 
I feel like punch count wise, Alex Dunn landed more shots. Uh, Alex Dunn at landed more shots. Alex Chavez landed a little bit more power shots. Yeah, so we'll see fair. how the judges scored that. Fair. Very close first round. Alex Dunn's left eye marked up. Both Chavez's guys lead leg is marked up. Both guys with a big smile getting ready to start this round too. Nothing funner than getting there in the cage and banging. Chavez has his hands a little low. Nice. Seen it. You're seeing it. Exactly, Alex. Yeah. Oh, that right hand again. Yeah, moving right hand again. Starting to mark up Dunn's left side of his head a little bit. Get some hands back to that face, bud. Yep. Put something in his eyes, Alex. Put something in his eyes, Alex. Don't wait for up. him. You know what you want to do. Still not any grappling exchanges here. I'm not sure which which guy's gonna have the advantage if it comes to that. I don't think either guy wanted to come to that. They're both just looking for a knockout. I agree. On the break cage up. control well, here now for Chavez. Oh, there's a right hand again on the way out. Keep that, keep that left hand busy, Alex. Keep that left hand busy. In his face. Yeah. Here we go. There's Chavez's up, straight up. jab. Left hand up on the action, man. Left hand up. He's falling, bro. That right hand's there. He's coming Crowd's to you. Crowd's awful quiet. So Crowd's awful back. quiet. Yeah. You can totally hear their coaches on both sides yelling. Wait till a couple of big shots, yeah, man. That'll yeah. Get going. High low, man. It's almost like old school when they would do shoe box and pride in Japan. The crowd right. would be all quiet. Yeah, when I fought in Pancras, it was super quiet. It was weird. The Tokyo Dome back in 2003. What a crazy experience. There you go, there you go. Nice. Oh, that right hand again. Yeah, right you know, hand. Dunn definitely has a chin, though. He's he's taken a lot of those right hands. Here we go There's, to the ground. Here's our scramble. Here's our first grappling exchange. Dunn with the single leg takedown. He's on top and half guard. Chavez looking for that deep half guard a little bit. Nice, nice up kicks there by Chavez. Oh, couple Ooh, that good one. up Ooh. kicks. Got to watch those. Dunn's knee was on the ground there. Let's see if Dunn can settle in here and slow this fight down a little bit. Shift your hips. Shift your hips. You have the underhook. Charvo's doing a great job there of controlling the wrist. Yeah, he's doing a great job of keeping guard, getting his legs in. I don't think I don't think Dunn wants Chavez standing back up. Oh! Chavez back to his feet. Got up the kick got through a little bit. 10 second mark here. Got a great round. A little more action this time. Oh. oh. Caught him with that left. That's a wow, that solid takedown led to the scramble, led to the up kicks. Chavez gets back to his feet. That was a good round. Yeah, that last right hand from Chavez landed pretty good. You can see Dunn's eyes pretty swollen up now. That's why he shot in on that single leg and got the takedown. He did get that takedown, a little bit of ground and pound, but he was eating those up kicks, so it's hard to say who won that round. I might have to give that to Chavez landing that big right hand, and those yeah. are some nice and those clean up, up kicks. kicks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Good fight for the opening fight tonight. Oh. Here we go, the replay. Here you see those body shots. That might have been at the end of the first round. Jeff Hoyby kicking the teams out. Yeah, you can see Dunn's, Dunn's left eyes nice and swollen from those short right looping hands. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we go to the Chavez and final ring. round makes That's some what I noise. See. Let's go, baby. We're here to entertain. Yeah, here we go. Nice big smile on both guys. I think both guys have to know it's probably one to one. Oh. There we go. Yeah, let's let it all hang yeah. out. Dunn's doing a good job of coming forward. He's got to watch that overhand yeah. right from Chavez. He's definitely doing a good job pressing the action now, but he's got to watch for that right hand. Right. He can't see. Right. 
Here's corner Tony pushing to the right. He can't see. That uppercut landed. Dunn looking for that takedown again. He's on that single. Almost oh. took our screen out over here. Dunn with another takedown right shot. in the center of the cage. Recovering that closed guard. See how their BJJ skills are. Oh, oh. another up kick. Man, he's doing a great job of landing those. I love those up kicks. Down in a half guard. Oh, going for a knee bar. Nice Chavez knee bar rolling there. out of it. Rolling out of it and on the top. That's the danger of attacking knees and, and ankles, right? You, you might take some shots, you might end up stuck on bottom. Big danger, I've warned a lot of my young fighters about that. It's not worth the risk sometimes in this close of a fight. That could cost Dunn the fight. That He's could stuck cost him the fight, yeah. For the rest I would of say, round. unless you know for He's a gonna... fact you're going to lock it up and have it, don't go for it. All right, Dunn back up to his feet. Oh. Chavez Chava. looking a little tired. Yeah, he's taking a big deep breath there, pulling up the shorts. Both been now being patient, picking their shots, because they know the next one could but one out. I see Dunn's eye. Pretty swollen there. I'm not sure how good he can see out of that left eye. Whoever whoever wants this fight's gonna win it right now in this round in the last yeah. minute. Oh, there's that right hand again. Oh, but Dunn answers with a few of his own. Oh, and a head kick. Oh, yeah. Fight is still up for grabs, I feel like. Who wants it more? Nice defense there by Chavez. And working on that Kimura grip there to defend the single. Dunn doing a good job of keeping him against the cage. I'd see Dunn drive his hips in and his head up and get that hip lift. 10 seconds left. Dunn throwing some knees. There's a body shot. There, that one went through. Wow, great first fight of the great night. Great first fight. Feel like great fight by both guys. We've said this before. Man, it'd be a rough job being a judge on this God. one. I'm glad we're sitting here yes. calling these fights to hell a lot funner than making a decision on yes. who won. Yes. I think, I don't know if, if something happened to Chavez or if it was just a lot of work getting him off him, but when he stood up after that takedown, he looked winded. Here you see that failed knee bar attempt. And this is what Ed was saying. When you go for it, make sure you have it, because if you don't, your opponent can do just this. Roll out the back, be on top, and now he's in control. Here you see Chavez on top, being the more dominant one. Alex Chavez and Alex Dunn. Great opening fight by both guys. Our ring announcer, Mike Kendall, is gathering the scorecards from the judges. It's cool, people just walk up and ask to take pictures like we're not in the middle of doing something. It's fine. It's all good, we're multitaskers. <laughs> when we can be. Yeah, all right, know. folks. Mike Kendall in the ring with the official announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards. And the judges score this bout 29 28, 29 28, and 30 27. All for your winner by unanimous decision out of the red corner, Alex Chavez. Once again, the show is presented by Combat Games MMA.